So welcome back everybody. Today we're back on a Roku video tonight and we're going to go through the top five free, top five free, you know what I mean, top five free Roku applications for movie TV shows. There's a bit of live TV in there, all that that you can get on your device and it will help you watch everything. We all know with Roku it's a little bit more locked down than most streaming devices, but actually around the world it's one of the most popular streaming devices, especially for official apps. Lots of paid apps on there, like your Netflix, Prime, all those sort of apps. But actually, there is some great free apps on there, which will add to your content, and you can install them. I'm going to show you how to do all of that. Okay, so if you're a regular viewer, remember to hit like on this video and share it, and I'd appreciate if you watch till the end, even if you don't use a Roku device. And all of you, if you can let me know underneath what device you do use, because that really helps me out for what content we're going to bring you. And we are aiming to bring you weekly Roku videos, as always, going forward. So do hit that subscribe button if you're brand new here. So let's take a look at the top five, for me, Roku apps, which I think you should all have, especially for free ones, and they don't take up a lot of room. So we're going to start with Plex. No matter where you are around the world, you can sign up and you can skip sign up. So just skip's easy enough if you're not, not interested in signing in. And in Plex, you get a nice home with loads of what's on now. You've got a watch list, you can have live TV, movies and shows, discover section music plus you can add your own media to it and everywhere around the world has different content okay so what i have here may be different to you if you're in america and vice versa so you've got lots in your movies and shows lots in there and they're 100 percent free so you've got plenties in there okay you can go to categories if you want to we're just going to take a little scroll down there's some pics in there there's some most popular there's obviously most popular in the uk yours might be different and what you can do is you can click one if you want to play it and you click play. And here it goes. And that's straight on. You're going to get your little film and you'll be able to watch it. Obviously, like most applications, there is a advert beforehand and then you get into your film. But you have to it's all right, it's only at the beginning and you can obviously skip through if you want to. Films work in very high quality and really easy to watch. Brilliant. I'm not going to show too much of that because, you know, it's YouTube. So there's loads in there. You've got obviously your live TV section as well, where you can scroll through and you'll see lots of different channels, things like this, all on your device for free. And there we go. Again, I'm not going to scroll down too much and I'm not going to load any up, but check it out for yourself. Um, all of these I'm going to show you today are available in your add app section on your Roku. So I'm not going to show you how to install them. It's easy. Just go to add apps and search the names of the ones we're looking at. Okay, up second, Distro TV. Distro TV is actually around on quite a few different streaming devices. Works very well. Um, it's just a nice free application with multiple different options. It's just a little bit different to your others. Um, again, you've got a lot of live stuff there like Euro News, things like that. You can see it playing in the background. Um, I'm going to swap to on demand quickly because I don't want too much playing in the background there for us. And I'll blow what I can. OK, but we've got our topics underneath. You've got different channels. You've got continue watching. Obviously, the Euro News is on. I've blurred a little bit at the top there because let's not get ourselves in trouble. Sports and fitness, horror, drama, action thrillers. And again, if you find a film or whatever you want to watch action thriller, you can just click on them again and they will load up and watch for you. Another great app. This one has a very strange range of content, plus it has the live channels as well. Um, I'm going to get off this one quite quick only because it plays in the background and those sort of things can get us in trouble on YouTube. Okay, up with number three. We're going to go to Rakuten TV. I love Rakuten TV. It's a great app. And again, around the world works really, really well and a little bit different everywhere you're at. Another one with lots of news channels which can play in the background for you. Um, you've got a store where you can actually add a little bit more to it. Um, again here, underneath though, in the little family section, you've got free movies and TV shows, free kids TV, free movies for kids. You can go onto the free itself and you've got a really good range of films in this one. A really good range. Like Electra's a great film. Anger Management's a great film. All really good. Really good range in this for a free app. Okay. A free official app. Let me remind you. Really good range. Again, you can look at these and there's a really big range of live TV in this app as well. Um, Rakuten's really, really good in my eyes. I'm just going to scroll through so it doesn't play too much. But I think it's a brilliant live app and it's great on all platforms. There is a store. So if you wanted to do a little bit more, look, you can buy or rent things like June, 
Dune Part 2. You can buy or rent those sort of films, okay? Um, let's have a little look at the price on this. Okay, so rent is quite expensive, personally. Like, if you're going to rent it for $15.99, you might as well purchase it for $19.99. You can get vouchers as well. But again, we're not really looking at the paid side of things on this. We're just looking at the free content. And there was so much in there, okay? So much. So what have we done now? We've done... Was that one, two, three? Let's roll on to number four. Pluto TV. Many of you may have heard of Pluto TV. Another great application with a broad range of stuff. Lots of TV shows. We have to accept privacy stuff on everything these days. Stream now, pay later. Oh, no. Stream now, pay never. Again, it's another one. I'm going to swap onto On Demand so we don't show too much. But on Demand, you've got lots and lots of TV shows. There's some movies in there as well. As you can see, there's tons of different content in there. Extreme Fishing Challenge, Fishing Content. It all depends what you like. True Crime. Everyone likes a bit of true crime. You've got Emergency Stuff, Paranormal, New on Pluto TV, all the new stuff, Featured Stuff. And again, as you can see, it is kind of trying to play in the background. I've covered most of that up. You can just, again, click and play, click and play. You've got the original June there. Jeez, that's a TV series. Not something I've seen. Robocop TV series. You know, it's not that old, to be fair. Don't get me wrong, some of the stuff's not the newest. But again, that's why we said to you number four. Okay, last one. And everyone should have this one if you're using a Roku device. The last one, okay? Because everyone should have the Roku channel. Why wouldn't you? Because the Roku channel is set up for the Roku device. And it's another one with loads of films, loads of TV shows, loads of Roku originals, loads of stuff for your kids and your family, all in here. We're not going to be watching Ryan's World. But you know what I mean. There's a lot of content in here again. Again, great stuff, great content. But over those five, let me know your thoughts underneath which one you prefer. Also, let me know in the comments if there's any I've missed and you think is a good one we should add to our Roku device. There's a couple of live TV ones which... I was going to put into this, but they've kind of stopped working at the minute. So when they come back, they may make it to next week's video for you, okay? But again, the Roku channel is always worth having because it's another great channel, lots of content. And you know the Roku one's going to work well because we're on a Roku device. Brilliant. So before we disappear, um, obviously, if you're a Roku user, do remember to subscribe because on our YouTube channel, let me just have a little search. If you hit that magnifying glass there, you can type in Roku. And we have lots of Roku videos for you about things you can do on your Roku, settings you need to turn off, uh, setup guides, how to unlock and install new app. You know, all this sort of content is all in there for your Rokus. And we're going to be adding more and more over the next few weeks. So do hit that follow button and hit subscribe. And a real quick word from a partner before we leave. If you are into your streaming, if you are after a VPN, whether it's for your mobile phone, possibly your streaming device, your PC, IP Vanish is a partner of ours. We do get a small commission from them. So if you do want to support the channel, sign up to IP Vanish, which is linked underneath, does help us out and support the channel. Brilliant. So I've been Dr. Swiffy. Really appreciate your time. If you've watched to the end, let me know if you have. Thumbs up, hit follow, and I'll see you soon.